Thank you. Um, kind of surprised to be the first person up here. <laughs> but I am one of the people who did actually vote for this plan uh, in the committee. And I have to tell you, I'm also not happy with it. Um, I understand that if it didn't get passed, it would be a huge roadblock to either district getting anything done. But my greatest disappointment in this plan is the lack of emphasis on recharge. We are not recharging the water we need to recharge, and consequently, the upper Florida aquifer is getting lower and lower and lower all the time. One of our key recharge assets are the Keystone Lakes, recharging three to five billion gallons per year. It's an amazing amount of water. But when the full depth of the lakes aren't there, the full pressure of those lakes is not driving water into the upper Florida aquifer. And if I do nothing else, I want people to understand that problem. Um, a lot of people on the committee worked very hard for what I thought was a two-year commitment, and it turned out to be a four-year commitment. It's a difficult process. All of this is. But the environmental side of the house is underrepresented on that committee. It's underrepresented in everything we do. We really, really need to preserve water in North Florida and recharge the upper Florida aquifer. Thank you.